Menu 18, beef ravioli and meat sauce. Let's see what we have today. Beef ravioli, cranberries, lemon lime knockoff Gatorade, cooking sleeve, toasted corn nuggets, corn nuts. Got our spoon. Luckily, a coffee today. That's nice. And we've got what is here? Cheese spread with something. Cheese spread with jalapenos. Cheese spread with bacon. I don't know. We'll find out. Hot beverage bag. Flameless ration heater. White wheat snack bread. This one's a little bit more on the uncommon side. Pretty windy today, but look at that scenery. It's kind of pretty. Got the heater, beef ravioli. While this cooks, I'm gonna put this down on a rock or something and we'll get to the accessories. I was hoping cheese spread with bacon. This is a rarity. The only thing more rare than this is the chocolate peanut butter, which is my favorite. It is so good. You don't want to put on bread or crackers because you'll ruin it. I just eat that thing straight from the, the tube. But uh, this will be a nice little treat. I'll open this up for demonstration purposes. The only problem with these things is like the opening is like right in the middle, so there's like really no way, good way to open these, but uh, the top is serrated so you can kind of like split the top and like rip it down the side a little bit. And just got corn nuts. It's corn! But these are dehydrated. If these were in a corn nut package inside the MRE wrapper, you'd probably be able to see how expired they are. So these one of my favorites to save as a snack. They're basically like ocean spray cranberries. Put them in a pocket in your pants. Like suck on them when you're on a hike. There's a few times in the field I put it in my lip. People would be like, hey, do you chew? I'm like, no, nah, they're cranberries. Like, the cranberries like in your in your cheek like it's chewing tobacco and just suck on them then like the extra the extra like play the part you need like a Gatorade cup so you can like spit into it but I never got into that I was just like eating the cranberries looking like some of the other guys dipping in the field you know Ingredients, cranberry, sugar, sunflower oil. That's it. Just like the corn nuts, just like the ingredients of corn, sunflower oil, and salt. Just like really simple, really tasty. Not that unhealthy for you. And obviously if you're in the field, you'll be sweating. You need to get that salt back. So this is a good way to get it. Sometimes you get Tabasco, sometimes you get this knockoff Tabasco. 
bouillards of Louisiana pepper sauce made with Tabasco peppers. So it's like, they cheaped out on you, you didn't get the Tabasco. This stuff is pretty good. Flip this over, make sure it gets cooked both ways. And as always, I'm putting memories on the side of the heater rather than in the heater like they're supposed to, just because this keeps things a little bit nice, tidier, rather than making a mess when you're in the field. So I wish I had some crackers for that cheese, but let's go with the white wheat snack bread. Cheese spread with bacon. A rare, rare treat. I'm gonna try to get this on camera. Hopefully it's not too chunky or too runny. Uh, don't really see any of the bacon bits. Oh, uh, there's one. You can kind of see one of the little chunks of bacon right there. Hard to tell. There's, there's one piece right there where it's dark on the cheese. Oh, and there's another little piece right there. Debatable if it's better than the jalapenos. But this would go really good with the um, beef patty pepper jack wannabe cheeseburger. Another little spot you can kind of make out. That's a little dark right there. Let's get these raviolis out. Pretty warm, not too hot. Shouldn't be surprised that these are not very good. It's basically Chef Boyardee in a pouch. And there's never enough sauce on these things. And you just see that in that golden hour evening light. I got little raviolis with some congealed sauce. And just like, man, if they just had a little more sauce. And these things are so small. Like this is obviously like for like kid sized. See, that's three raviolis in one spoon. And it's fairly dry. There's a little piece of beef. Pretty bland, pretty dry. I think I'll put some of that Louisiana sauce on. Smells like Tabasco. Maybe a bit more vinegar and a little bit less heat. And that looks not very red. That looks like it's expired and a little bit clear in brown and yellow. Yeah, that, I'm pretty sure that's expired. So let's go with some expired hot sauce. Let's see what happens. If I post this video, it'll be in about two or three days. So you'll know I lived. I think that's actually worse. At least it's wetter now. But that sauce is definitely expired.
come to think of it, I didn't get a dessert. I guess um, the cranberries are a fruit. So that was your dessert. I'd love to get some like Skittles or some Reese's Pieces. I got ripped off today.